Finally, my facial hair looks perfect today. No, I'm just joking. Anyway, so today I want to talk about the difference between thinking and sensing because nobody knows what the difference between thinking and sensing is. I ask people, what would you be doing if you weren't thinking? And they say, I'd be dead or it's not possible as if they're always thinking. Now, there is a difference. And the difference is when you're in reality, you're sensing, you sense reality. When you see something, you're not imagining that you see something. You don't think you hear me because if you thought you could fly, then you would be. But since you can't fly when you think you're flying, thinking is not reality. Now, the reason why people are confused between the two is because you are sensing what you are thinking. Therefore, in order for us to be able to think, we had to be able to sense what we were thinking. So one could not exist without the other. However, reality has no beginnings and no endings, and a thought has a beginning and an ending. It ends when you go back into reality, and it begins when you leave reality. And the one way to know if somebody's thinking when you're talking to them is if they're scratching their heads. Because usually, while you're having a thought, you'll do a fidget. It could be anything. It could be like, oh, you scratch your nose, or, you know, and it's a clear sign to know if somebody's not listening to you because they probably have attention deficit disorder. So what are you doing if you're not paying attention? You're using one of your four other senses or you're thinking. But most people are always thinking. So we can assume that most people are thinking when they're not listening or paying attention. So instead of attention deficit disorder, I've changed... I've changed the word to be thinking surplus disorder or HTSD, which is hyperactive thinking surplus disorder. Makes more sense, don't you think? Because thinking is not a sense. Thinking is non-sensing. Non-sense is senseless. Your senses have become defenseless.